Tesla Model 2 is really coming. Unofficially called the Tesla Model 2, the anticipation for a below $20,000 price tag hatchback is increasing as the developments in Tesla's EV tech become more promising. It would make sense to do, um, I guess, a compact car, so perhaps a hatchback or something like that. And um, something that, like, well, what do most people want? The Tesla Model 2 is one of the most impressive cars of this decade. Not only is it supposed to bring electric mobility to the crowds with its $25,000 base price, but it could also revolutionize the way EVs are made. Welcome to Smart Sense. Elon Musk is challenging the whole EV market once again. At the moment, Tesla's cheapest car on sale is the Model 3 with an initial price of $37,990 to get the standard Range Plus model. A more affordable standard trim was sold for $35,000 but was suspended last year due to a lack in demand. However, an even more affordable $25,000 compact Tesla aimed at the mass market has been in the pipeline for several years. Back in 2018, Elon Musk declared he wanted to originate a $25,000 car in three years when battery technology would be updated and EV manufacturing costs reduced. Today, in 2021, Tesla still doesn't sell a low-cost $25,000 car slotting below the Model 3 and Model Y. Now we know that Tesla's cheap compact car would be designed at a research center at Tesla's Gigafactory in Shanghai. Tesla's new entry-level model will also be built in China. While it will majorly be aimed at the Chinese market, where small electric cars are trendy, the $25,000 electric car will be sold worldwide to be available in the US. This will fill the blank of small EVs in America since models like the Volkswagen ID3 and Honda e aren't sold here. Tesla is currently building the dedicated research and development center to design, engineer, develop, and test the forthcoming compact car. This will be the foremost Tesla R&D center in China and the first outside the US. Tesla China even wants to design, develop, and produce its own Tesla car that appeals to global markets. As for the design, the new small electric car is expected to have hatchback body style and the same platform as the Model 3. While it likely won't launch for a few years until Tesla can manufacture cheaper batteries, road testing of the automaker's new compact car could start later this year. The, uh, what, what we see is really the fundamental uh, impediment to progress with batteries is the cost. So um, <clears throat> if, you've got, if you've got range, if you've got rapid recharge, um, and, um, and that all, that all those can be achieved, and, and a, a high calendar and high cycle life, um, so you know, batteries can last like, like 15 years, which I would believe ours currently can, then the, the, what, what it comes down to most of all is uh, improving the cost so that the affordability of batteries is of, of, of battery powered cars and electric vehicles um, is improved and so that er everyone can afford to buy an electric car that's that's really what we see as the the, the fundamental thing that needs to be improved so a twenty five thousand dollar model two could well outsell all other forthcoming tesla models combined due to that cost and the appetite for its target markets, especially China, leading some industry observers to argue that it should be a top priority for the automaker rather than the disputedly styled Cybertruck or the pricey rocket-assisted Roadster. The car would be manufactured in China for the home market and also exported worldwide. Pickup trucks, EV or not, are not as significant a segment in China or Europe as in the US, although China produces many for export and the Roadster is expected to have a price tag well above $100,000, limiting its volume potential. A hatchback valued at under $25,000 could dwarf even Model 3 sales on multiple continents, though thinner profit margins than the Roadster or Cybertruck work against it. Another problem is that the rest of Tesla's lineup is now a bit dated by traditional automaker product cycle timelines. The Model S is 10 years old and is only just receiving a facelift and interior update. The Model 2 is an exciting scenario for Tesla's efforts in China. At the moment, China is a spicy hotpot for EVs and a market in which miniature vehicles are more welcomed with eager arms. Unclear is if Tesla would adopt the Model 3 platform as a point of departure for such a hatchback or anything smaller and far contrasted. The fastest and easiest way out could perhaps be a hatchback body style that requires much of the Model 3 platform and tooling, but with a tiny 244-mile battery the company has largely avoided offering. 
The Model 2 would also need to insert advanced autonomous tech on board, making the $25,000 target challenging for a Model 3 based hatch to hit. Nonetheless, it is a Model 3 based hatchback, along with a few classic cost cutting measures such as steel wheels and unpainted bumpers. It's doubtful that Tesla, being sensitive to design most of the time, would risk unpainted bumpers and steelies. A hatchback based gradually on Model 3 architecture might have made sense in 2017 when Model 3 production started, but would be dated by a 2023 production target. Still, a hatchback body is expected given the tastes of the European and Chinese markets. But how much versatility buyers will demand from it remains to be defined. Tesla's official sketch pictured it as more of a coupe, which certainly looks attractive from a design standpoint, but may not precisely maximize interior space in markets where it's possible to be the only car in a household. This is why the Nissan Leaf and Chevy Bolt are fashioned as large hatchbacks or small station wagons. As much as Tesla has been pushing the Cybertruck and the Roadster, its genuine volume seller in the first half of this decade would be its sub-Model 3 offering for China, whether it takes the Model 2 name or not. It remains to be discussed whether Tesla can stick to its plan to introduce the vehicle ahead of rivals in China and elsewhere. Tesla has become synonymous with electric vehicles. From mainstream brands to Uber luxury marquees, all automakers give consumers their antidote to the universal and now common Tesla that have silently yet masterfully seized the freeways and local roads Americans cross each day. Hate it or love it, Elon Musk shook up the pompous, staid automotive industry and single-handedly declared the term electric vehicle as his company's own. EVs may merely account for 1.7% of US auto sales, but the majority are Teslas, namely the Model 3. Elon Musk concentrated on performance and technology and effectively captured a demo in the US that was up for grabs, the young tech-oriented car buyer. Tesla has encouraged a loyal and passionate following. Every EV that doesn't have a Tesla badge is at a constant disadvantage. Tesla showed us that EVs could be stylish, fun, and accessible. The next genuinely revolutionary car is the affordable 250 mile range EV, and that's where Model 2 will blow up the market. But there, I'm sure there'll be others as well, but I, that, that, that might be the wise place to start. Um, and it, it helps us also say, okay, we need a car that people can afford, uh, that fits their lifestyle and everything, and so probably something like that would make sense. Um, yeah, I'm excited about doing some original design. So, what do you think? Will Tesla Model 2 change the EV market once again? Or are there other players on the field who might do that? Let us know in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so you don't miss an upload, and you can enjoy the excellent content we send your way.